Last night, around 2 a.m., I stumbled into a wild corner of GitHub, Instagram OSINT tools. These aren't secret hacker tools, they're open source scripts anyone can find and use. It hit me, we share so much on Instagram, but rarely think about how easily it can be collected and analyzed. These tools automate the process, piecing together a detailed picture from public data. No hacking, just smart aggregation of what's already out there. Today, I'll walk you through four of these tools, what they do, and what they reveal about our digital footprints. This is all about awareness, seeing how public data can be used and what it means for your privacy. Let's dive in. First up is InstaRecon. Think of it as a digital mirror for your Instagram profile. It scrapes public-facing data, username, full name, bio, follower and following counts, number of posts, and your profile picture URL. If your account is public, it grabs everything you display, including whether you're a business or private account. It even checks tagged photos, so not just what you post, but what others tag you in. That means your digital footprint isn't just your own posts, but also your network's public activity. The process is lightning fast. Enter a username, and in seconds, you get a summary of all public info. It's a reminder that privacy settings matter. A private account drastically limits what can be scraped. InstaRecon doesn't hack or guess, it just collects what's already visible. Seeing all your public data organized in one place is eye-opening. It's a wake-up call to review your profile from an outsider's perspective. Are you comfortable with what's out there? InstaRecon is simple, but it shows how much context can be built from just your public profile. It's the baseline for understanding your digital storefront. If your bio lists your email, city, or website, it's all there for anyone to see. The tool's speed and efficiency make it powerful. Imagine this at scale, across hundreds of accounts. It doesn't access private posts or DMs, but it's a strong argument for using privacy settings. InstaRecon is a perfect illustration of what a stranger sees when they land on your page. It's not about creating new info, just collecting what's already public. The lesson? Review your own profile regularly. Ask yourself, is this the story I want to tell the world? InstaRecon makes it clear, public data is more revealing than you think. It's a simple tool, but a powerful reminder. Your digital mirror is always on. What's it reflecting? If InstaRecon is the mirror, IGOSYNT Toolkit is the analyst. It doesn't just collect data, it organizes and analyzes it for deeper insights. The toolkit pulls recent posts, captions, likes, comments, and timestamps, compiling engagement metrics automatically. It scrapes hashtags and builds a word cloud, revealing your interests and communities. Location tags. It lists every place you've checked into, mapping your routines and favorite spots. The output is a structured report, profile summary, post analysis, hashtag usage, and location history. It even looks for other usernames in bios and comments, mapping your network and possible alternate accounts. Suddenly, your digital footprint isn't just a pile of facts, it's a story. Patterns emerge, when you're active, what you care about, who you interact with. All from public data, no hacking, just smart observation. IG OSINT shows the power of organization raw data becomes actionable intelligence. It's a reminder that your online life is a data set, ready to be analyzed. The more you post, the clearer your story becomes. This tool highlights how structure can reveal more than the data itself. It's not just about what you share, but how it all connects. IG OSINT takes us from data collection to data enrichment. Your digital footprint is more than random posts. It's a narrative. The lesson? Be mindful of the patterns you create. Organized data tells a story. Make sure it's the one you want. IG OSINT is a powerful reminder. Your public posts are more connected than you think. Now, let's level up with Turbogram, a tool that links your Instagram to your entire online presence. It scrapes Instagram like the others, but its real power is in cross-platform correlation. Turbogram hunts for pivot points, like emails or usernames, that connect your Instagram to Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn, and more. If you use the same username or email across platforms, Turbogram can find and link those accounts. This is called username enumeration, and it's shockingly effective. The tool cross-references profile pictures, bios, and linked websites to confirm matches. Suddenly, your personal, professional, and casual personas are all connected. It's a wake-up call about compartmentalizing your digital life. 
using different usernames, emails, and profile pictures for each platform makes this kind of mapping much harder. Turbogram shows that your digital footprint isn't limited to one app, it's a web of interconnected accounts. The privacy implications are huge, your carefully separated online identities can be merged in seconds. This is advanced OSINT, data correlation, not just collection. It's a lesson in operational security. If you want privacy, keep your digital world separate. Turbogram is the next evolution, mapping your entire online presence with alarming efficiency. Your digital life is more connected than you realize. One piece of public info can unravel your whole web. The takeaway? Be intentional about your online identities. Cross-platform tools like this make privacy a moving target. The last tool, despite its name, Instahack, isn't a hacking tool at all. It's a metadata aggregator, pulling every piece of public info and metadata from a profile and its posts. It collects the basics, username, bio, follower counts, post details, but it goes deeper, grabbing direct URLs for every post, high-res profile pictures, and precise timestamps. With this, you can analyze posting schedules, active hours, and even infer time zones. It identifies account type, personal, business, creator, verified, and compiles engagement metrics. The final report is dense, years of public activity, all in one searchable document. It's a powerful example of unintentional data exposure. None of this is private, it's all info you've shared, just aggregated. Instahack collapses years of posts into a single, detailed portrait. The danger isn't hacking, it's the slow leak of public info that when combined, reveals more than you intended. This tool is a digital dragnet, showing the cumulative effect of small disclosures. The lesson? Every public detail adds up. Be mindful of what you share, because aggregation tools don't miss a thing. Instahack isn't about breaking in, it's about connecting the dots you've already left. Your metadata tells a story. Make sure it's one you're comfortable sharing. The real risk is in the details you didn't realize were public. That's our tour of Instagram OSINT tools, each one showing how public data can be collected, organized, and analyzed. Your digital footprint is more like a shadow, detailed, persistent, and often bigger than you think. This isn't about fear, it's about awareness and control. Review your profiles, check your privacy settings, and think about the story your public data tells. Small changes, like going private or scrubbing old location tags, can make a big difference. If this opened your eyes, drop a like and subscribe for more deep dives. The more we understand these tools, the safer we can be online. Thanks for watching. See you in the next rabbit.